Okay, what we have here is a Black Widow uh, Silverado truck, 1500, with a lift kit on it, 22 inch fuel wheels, and it was wrecked in the front, but I painted it, and I bought it, man, put it together. And right now, what I'm gonna be doing today is uh, putting this Black Widow uh, decal, not decal, but it's like a, a stencil. So I'm going to show y'all the process of putting it on here. I had already refinished the hood. Refinished the hood. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I refinished the hood. Front grill. Painted the bumper. Painted the uh, fender flare here. Painted that door. Blended on the rear door. And on this side, I uh, painted this fender, as I said, and blended on this door here. So, like I said, what we're going to be doing is going to be installing this uh, Black Widow stencil on the hood. I'm going to show y'all the process of it. So let me get the hood all taped up. Tip around my edges here so I won't get overspray on my uh, fender and you know, on my windshield and stuff. Let me get that taped up and I'm going to cut you right back on. Alright, I want to show y'all something too. Another thing too, so you won't have to tape up all of this up under here, you do a thing that's called back taping. What you do is you get your little three inch tape here. So, Alright, get the tape and you just tape the back side right here. And once you tape the back side, once you close your hood, close your hood down. And get your paper and lay on that tape all the way around the edge of the uh, hood, all the way around. And you won't have to worry about you know taping up the engine there and stuff. Just a little quick tip. Okay, what we're gonna do now <clears throat> before we put our stencil down, we're gonna sand our entire hood down with a uh, Merca 800. That's the Merca 800 right there that I'm using on my uh, DA. A little Merkel DA. I mean, you use basically any DA. Doesn't really matter. But uh, I'm gonna sand this entire hood. Down. And the reason I'm sanding it down is because once I lay my emblem down, I'm not gonna be able to sand. I mean, once I lay my stencil down, I'm not gonna be able to sand the hood. So I'm gonna go on the sand the hood, lay my stencil down, spray the black inside the stencil, pull the stencil up and clear the entire hood. So let's get this hood sanded. <clears throat> okay. What I'm gonna do now, uh, I pretty much got it centered up where I want it. Uh, about right there in the center of the hood. Back up a little bit. Towards the front. What I'm gonna do now is peel my, uh, my backing paper off. That's this paper on the back right here. This paper right here. Pull that off right quick. So I'm gonna get this pulled off, and I'm gonna line it up where I want it, right here. All right, now what I'm gonna do now is pull my transfer paper off. Transfer paper is just right here in my hand. Try to get that. Bubbles right on the edge. 
I'll make sure those are out because I don't want any paint bleeding up under there. Side, but it's all taped off because I don't want to get any black, no overspray on the head. So let me get that taped up and I'm cut you right back on. Alright, got my hood all taped off, all my white, so I don't get any uh, black overspray on. So what I'm going to do now, right, all everything that's, that's white is going to be black. So when I peel this, this up, it's just going to leave the black spider, the black widow on the uh, impression on the hood. Just a little paint Move our paper. Try to do this with one hand. Make our head. Get this clear on here. And here it is, all done. Put the spider on the head. 